back to another brand new aviation jack video hope you're all doing very very well um so, so today we are going to be talking about Microsoft flight 7 2020 and how to install liveries now i first i found this really difficult so i'm going to try and show you a really simple easy way to do it um just remember your installation directory so wherever you installed it is where these folders are going to be so just make sure you remember where you installed it if you left it on a default installation where you just done everything you've done on its own then I will show you how to do it that so way. First as of well. all, what you want to do is is go to download a livery mega pack. So here I have one liveries mega pack right here. You see it? And then in these A320, A320 Neo, all of the liveries that I can now use. Now to download these livery mega packs, which you're probably wondering where they are, how can I download them? Because I can't find them. You go to the Discord. So if you don't have Discord, go sign up for it. Go to Discord and then go to the Flight Center 2020 uh, server. You can join the server if you just type it on the internet, just type in MSFS2020 Discord server and you'll, you know, it'll pop up. Uh, what you want to do is you want to come down here to the liveries release. And on the liveries release, you have all of the liveries that you can download here. Yeah, so here you go, Drive for KLM A320. You can download all of these liveries, not a problem. Okay, so once you've downloaded that, what you want to do is you're going to come to where you downloaded it. So in my case, in my downloads, you're going to extract the folder. So you get it in this little yellow folder and it's called Liveries Mega Pack or whatever livery you downloaded. It doesn't need to be the Mega Pack. Whatever one you've had is perfect. Go to it, go to Liveries Mega Pack. And then inside you have uh, Liveries Cessna, if you want to do any Cessna liveries. But we're not going to go through that today. We're just going to do the Liveries A320. You want to, before we start doing this, we're going to put this on to the right. And then what we're going to do is we're going to find out where uh, we're going to put the folder. So what you want to do is if you've installed this in your own, um, if you installed it default and you didn't give it a new directory, then this is where you want to find your uh, community and official folders. So you're going to go to your name and then go to app data, local, packages, which is down here somewhere, there we go, packages. And this is where it looks a bit difficult, but if you've got it um, in alphabetical order, it'll be fine. You want to go to Microsoft Flight Simulator, this one. And go to local cache, local cache, whatever you want to call it. Go to packages, and inside this, not in mine, obviously, but inside will be your community and official folders. All right? So just imagine they're there for me. What you want to do is, is in, in uh, copy the liveries A320 folder, like so, and then go to your community folder and then paste it in here. So mine is in my documents because I uh, redone the directory because I didn't want it in there. I just, I just wanted to be quite quick and just wanted to be in documents like so. But then you just want to paste it in there and then that is it. You have no problems. Just paste the whole folder. Here they are, all in here. And I'll see in there, you can also see the Orbex landmarks on the city pack because I also uh, installed the Orbex London pack. So everything goes into community and that is it. You, it to install liveries simple as anything and then what you want to do just to make sure they're working of course is to go into Microsoft Flight Center 2020 and then you should get this beautiful livery this is a flight that I done from Madrid to Gatwick in the EasyJet 320 Neo so that's it that's all how you do to install liveries if you want well I will be doing it down below I'm going to put a step to step guide in the description so in case you didn't quite get it in the video um, the be a guide down below Okay, well, thank you for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it's helped. Uh, make sure you subscribe, like, and comment. Not comment, you have to comment. You can share it if you want. Oh, yeah, so share if you think anyone would benefit off this video. Subscribe if, obviously, you want to see more. There'll be a full flight video coming out soon in MSFS 2020. And, obviously, we'll be doing P3D flights as well. Um, we're not going to stop doing P3D flights because we've got FS Labs and PMDG in there, so not a problem. But yeah, that's it. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.